feel after going out there on Saturday? Uh, I felt great, honestly. Um, we, there were so many good things that the team did, and honestly, we're just really excited for this season. And you know, first college, first college hit. My first play, I got hit a little bit, but I bounced right back, right back up. And practice and things, and my other teammates prepared me well for that. So it was a good feeling to get out there. Said something to you. What did you say back? Oh uh, no, nah, he didn't. He didn't say anything. I just wanted to make sure that he knew that I was gonna come the whole time, every game. Not, not one little hit is gonna keep me down. So that's all. That's all I said. How have you kind of been able to separate yourself in a very talented running back group? Um, honestly. I think we're all we all doing we we all do a great job of at the same thing, you know. Devon's bigger back, so he's better at blocking and stuff. Greg's just all around. He's he's good, and I'm I'm just a little bit faster. So we all got our just three different things that we can come together. We can just we all gonna be great together. So yeah. Was it easy for you to kind of fit in there, right? When, you know, because I know you came in a little later and you started right away at five. Came. Oh yeah, it was easy. I mean. Um, the conditioning and stuff, it wasn't it wasn't hard for me. Like the beat test, that, that stuff wasn't hard. It was just kind of the mental stuff, getting in the playbook, because Coach Frost, his playbooks, it's a big playbook. So I just had to get in there and get to learning and get the speed of the game and stuff. Still stuff I got to get used to, but I'm excited to see my college football career is going to go. What was the moment like when you found out that you were going to qualify, that you were going to be able to come here? How big of a relief was that for you? That was that was one of the most blessing things that could ever happen to me, just because I went through so much with like rulings and stuff where they never really went my way, and um, for me to get that, that was just like that was the most important one to me to get. So I felt really blessed, and I was really excited. And from there, I'll just hurry up and get on this plane so we can get you out here. Yeah. What were you doing during that time to make sure that you could be ready so you could contribute right away your first game in your college career? Are you talking about the time like when, when you're waiting for that answer, when you're waiting to oh, find out? Um, I could only do what I could, so I was working. Um, I was going to 24-hour fitness. I didn't have a gym. I didn't have a school really to go work out and stuff. So I just got a couple guys that I knew that are that play football out there now. We were just working all the time. And still trying to just stay focused, like, okay, if this doesn't go through, then I still have a life to live and stuff like that. But I'm here now, so that's great. When, when Coach Frost came to you in, in January and you had your first kind of meeting with him when he stopped at your school and everything else, what about Nebraska was compelling? Because I know you were looking at Arizona State pretty hard at that time too. Uh, one of the things was I talked about before was the corner versus running back thing, and he was telling me how – if you want to be a running back, if you want to go to the league, your best way of doing that, I see, is a running back. And, you know, I just had to listen to those. But on my visit, it was really great to meet the guys, too. And um, I met a lot of guys from a lot of different schools. But I was like, okay, I can make it. This could be my family here. And um, this could, I can make this my home. And so I was like, okay, I like it here, and I'm, I'm going to come here. Did you just feel like you could instantly kind of trust him and the coaching staff when you got to meet Oh, yeah. Them? Oh, yeah, instantly, especially talking to guys from, like, UCF and some of the guys here now, I knew that we had something great going and that we were just going to be great. And um, I felt like I could help, and then they could help me, too, and learning a lot of stuff. And, yeah, that, I wanted to be a part of that. What did you know about the running back tradition at Nebraska before you came here, if, if anything? I knew a little bit. I didn't know too much, honestly. I didn't know that, like, widespread. And, um, you know, I just – I really came for the coaches and, and the players. It was more like – I didn't really know much about Nebraska tradition at all. I just knew that these were group guys that I wanted to be with for the next three to four years, and that was ultimately what made my decision. Thanks, Mark. Thanks, Mark. Thank, Thank you. you.